I like how much lore this has, despite looking like a straight-up shooter. Uh, it was similar in the last game, too. In Last Doom, there's a lot going on under the hood. Um, and, you know, depending on how much time you want to put into that, you're going you're gonna to get um, more or less out of it. Just checking these other platforms. See where they take us. If anywhere. <laughs> Any bets that was about the Doom Slayer? I mean... I would say probably. Okay, so that one falls. Alright. How are we supposed to get up there? Sick. See, even though so even though sometimes we don't see it marked on the map, uh, I find that just going to every spot and covering it with our green slime uh, is pretty beneficial. Hey, Shadow says, we watch your Darkest Dungeon vids on YouTube, and I love them, so thanks for that. Hey, thanks, buddy. I'm glad that you like them. I am honestly addicted to Darkest Dungeon right now, and it takes a lot of willpower for me to not play, like, two weeks ahead of recording, you know? How am I supposed to get up there? Oh, I see. I see where we're at. Oh, that was close. Yikes, yikes, yikes. There we go. What the hell is this? A Slayer Gate. Slayer Gates are optional intense encounters. Ammo and extra lives spent in the Slayer Gate will not be restored. Completion awards three weapon points and an Empyrean key. Each Slayer Gate is unlocked with a Slayer Key, which is near the gate. Okay. Gotta find a Slayer Key. Gotta unlock the gate. Then you get the weapon points, then you get an Empyrean Key. So we gotta find a key for this, and they say it's near the gate. Oh, it even shows you. Okay, so I'm probably gonna have to go in here, up and around, I suppose. Whoa. Whoa. That was no small feat. <laughs> That's cool. There it is. Slayer key. Okay, guys, I don't know how many attempts this is going to take, but buckle up. Mainheart says, love all your vids. The storylines you make with the characters are awesome. I have so much time to catch up on Darkest Dungeon, too. Nice, man. And thanks, Jimmy. You guys are so kind. Ten. Ten attempts. Thirty. I'm buckled. I'm, I, I'm clenched. Butt cheeks clenched. Hey, Saku. Let's just... Let's just check out our surroundings here. <laughs> I'm just delaying the inevitable. We could just leave.
Oh, wow. Kill 666 demons? We've done it. So far, so good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I love how you can see their momentum chasing you. And then you go through the portal. Damn. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Whoa. Oh, I can't get him either. We're in deep shit here. Come on, health. Okay, so we're getting... Okay, so the first batch is like regular dudes. The second batch is the dudes with the things on the back. I'll, I'll probably switch to the micro-missiles for them. Trying to blast those things off with the uh, shotgun. The reload time is pretty slow. What kind of FPS we're getting? Really, uh, really high. I can show you something if you want to see. Um, inside here... There's something for, where is it? Maybe in video? Performance metrics. So you can see 120 FPS pretty consistently. If you want, I can leave that on for just like one fight here. I'll turn off uh, all the extra detail. Just have the FPS. Did I ding? Did I did I miss a ding? Or did I ding there? Okay, I got a ding. Jeez. Oh, I'm out of fuel. Damn, my bad. That was a, that was a crappy one. Okay. That's two dings, right? Two dings in here. Look at them all just hanging out. Oh, 
Oh, get me away from that. Ho! Oh. They take you down quick. Right to the, like you turn around and he's right next to you. And you're like, okay. Swivel chair. Got a final in an hour? You should probably spend it watching Doom. Wow. Some of the stuff that hits us, I can't even see where it's coming from. It's actually insane. Our first run was pretty good. Wow. There you go. That's how we should be doing it. Every once in a while, we just gotta blast one of those off. Ooh, I almost died there. That was so close. Oh, what happened? Are we back? Uh, just try refreshing. Yeah, no vid because we're just in the checkpoint. It sounds like Twitch has been having some problems today. All good? Okay, thanks, Wakiza. Okay.
Look at that. Holy moly. It's like a shitload. These guys tend to get kind of grouped up in a spot behind us. Oh, no. Damn. <sighs> that second round is uh, pretty insane. That second round is insanely hard. Punch them? Uh, it doesn't really work like that. Unless you're referring to when they're all grouped up. <laughs> Jesus. <gasps> Holy crap. Not gonna give up? Oh, no, we don't give up here. I'm gonna do this until we get it. Absolutely. I feel like the best way to do it is just like try to keep on as constant a path as you can. Like just try to keep like a pattern going, you know? And then you just kill what's in front of you, but man, it's definitely, definitely hard. Oh no! Not him. Uh oh. Swords come out of nowhere. We have uh, we have three guns. The other one uh, is the special add-on. I don't think is going to help us. Whew. How many deaths are we on this one? Eight.
Oh man. There we go. Like this is freaking wild. That's crazy. We did pretty good. That was our best one. That was our best one. Time for easy peasy mode. No, man. No way. Ooh. That was, uh, this is insane. I can't chainsaw that. What's up, Marty? Oh, did I forget a ding? I'll extra ding there. I couldn't remember if I did the last one. Whatever, pick up Dune 2016 again after this? Oh, I don't know. This one's an improvement in pretty much every way. And that says a lot because the previous one was really good. There's like no room to breathe. Might get me killed. dude jeez holy moly Whew. oh damn i was so close that was a waste
Look at all this armor. Yeah, Jesus. Wow. Whoa, dudes. I'll get me away from these barrels, bro. Oh, I'm stuck. Uh-oh, don't like that. Oh man, this is not good. Oh man, they throw like... What is that shit? Like throw beams of something. Beams of hell. Holy shit. Chat, do not jinx it right now. I'm shaking. Holy shit! Oh! Wow! <laughs> Holy moly! That's insane! That's insane! This is how people get strokes. Seriously. <sighs> wow. That was insane. That was insane. That was insane. That was insane. That was only the first one. Look, I imagine as we scale, the enemies obviously scale, but 
we're going to have more of an arsenal too, right? I feel like you run into these, you probably, th you probably are like, maybe we'll just come back to it, you know? Empyrean keys. Acquire all six Empyrean keys to activate the maker device in the Fortress of Doom, which unlocks the Unmaker. Yes. So there must be six, uh, six of those types of challenges then. How fun was that? Honestly, I feel so good now that we completed it. I feel so, so good. I don't know how long it took. But that is the most stressful... That's, I've, that's the most stressful thing I've ever encountered until probably the next one. So... Damn, that was wild. That was wild. Otter Honda. Nice to see you, buddy. Wakiza, thank you for the bits. Crezo, thanks for the seven months. Says, what did I miss? <laughs> what did he miss, guys? Nothing. Nothing. Everything's been perfect. Everything's fine. I think after this, I'm going to fire up, like, Stardew Valley. And, uh... And maybe I'll even... Maybe I'll even consider breathing for a bit. <sighs> How do I like Eternal? Oh, I love it, Lightwing. I love it. I'm having such a freaking blast. It's insane. We're playing on Nightmare Difficulty, which is like... I don't care who you are. It's hard. And it's really cool. Who needs breathing if you can play Doom? Exactly. Looks like the blood punch recharges super fast. You could be using it way more. Yeah, you know what? You're you're a hundred percent right. Hundred percent right. Um, the challenge for me is like paying attention to all the other stuff that's happening and then checking on that little meter. So it not for, definitely for clearing mobs and stuff that should come in handy and timing it uh, will be useful. Uh, wait a second here. Whoa, did you guys see that? <laughs> that was weird. <gasps> Am I going to stream my Stardew? No, 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 I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do it. Uh, hold on, let's see over here. Okay, so we have a wall there. That was hell being angry. The betrayer's life signal is nearby. Yes. Let's find that betrayer. I want to betray the hell out of something. I feel like this upper area might have some stuff going on, though. But I have no way of getting up there now. How long will I stream? Until I pass out from not breathing? Ooh. Ooh. Who's this? I told you all to leave me here. The betrayer? I am where I belong. Saving your people will not bring you peace. Only make the burden you carry worse. You guys on fire, but we're on fire by choice. <laughs> For intimidation. Clearly works very well. And now you seek to defy the con maker herself. It is your people's time now to give penance, just as it was mine. Hear me, Slayer. When his heart is laid to rest, then his soul will be at peace. And so will mine. Get to the exit portal. 
Uh, I could have used your help a few minutes ago. Just saying. Buddy. Look at these weapons. <laughs> like, what? That's so cool. That's awesome. How are you guys doing? You guys good? You hanging in there? How many of you are working right now? Notice how it forces us to keep our gun put away? A lot of people are working, yeah. Working from home, sure. Are any of you in, like, um, mandatory uh, quarantines? From where you're from? If so, I really hope that you're okay. The Betrayer. Yeah, see, I feel like uh, that weapon could be good. He should maybe help us. After years of prolonged war against the demonic threat invading their world, Argent Denur launched an offensive strike across Dimension, sending their greatest warriors into the heart of Hell itself. Despite their training and their preparedness, their, uh, their honor was undone by deceit. Betrayal at the highest levels of command left Argent Denur's bravest warriors cut off and scattered in the hellscape. <clears throat> Stop being so nice. <laughs> okay. They moved you to a night shift for social distancing? My wife actually had her shift switched. Um, so she works from home a few days a week, generally. But because everybody's working from home in the company and her job is considered like a non... Uh, Non-essential sounds bad, but essentially it's like less of a priority over the people that need to be using the, the Citrix network that they all work on. Uh, they told them if they want to work from home that they have to... Uh, work off hours so they basically have to they have to work uh 5 30 p.m to like 12 30 basically or 1 30 whatever it is um so she's been doing that which is pretty different but she likes it because obviously she's not going into the office and you're not exposing yourself to this stuff on public transit so Yeah, not business critical, exactly. That's exactly the term they use. And you feel like, you know, it's kind of sad because she's like, well, they said I'm not business critical. And you're like, yeah, I mean, I get it, but... Of these last remaining Night Sentinels, only one remained in hell by choice. Betrayer of the Argenta. It was Commander Valen. Valen? Different spelling. It's not. It can't be the same one, you guys. Who relinquished the keys to the Elemental Sepulchre in return for his son's resurrection. Haunted by demonic visions, the image of his son's tortured existence plagued him without relent, the whispers of demons pushing him towards madness. In a moment of weakness, he fell prey to the demon's trickery, sealing the fate of Argent Denur and dooming the kingdom to which he swore a lifelong oath to protect. Valen chose exile in the hellscape for his sacrilege. Okay. Okay. Retail work's considered essential, so I have to go to work. For now, man. A lot of retail places are closing. Um, by the way, chat, I want to say thank you guys for... Um, hold up. I want to say thank you guys for being, like, cool. <laughs> During these times, it's really easy for people to have a lot of opinions about what's happening, a lot of predictions about what's happening. Uh, it's really nice to be able to look at chat and not have people arguing about that stuff. So, um, I just want to say I appreciate that. Thank you. Salt Lake City's having an earthquake? Are you freaking serious? Ah. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. All we want is Doom Eternal and metal music. Yeah, I'm working on getting us to our next metal music set. Uh. Oh, I see where we are. Okay. I need to get up here somehow. That's where the secret is. I wonder if maybe I should jump from... 
Hold on. You think I can make this jump? <laughs> With ease! With ease! Damn! Aqua Demon. That's a lot of green on this map, you guys. Look! 100%. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Is there a way that we can, uh, is there a way we can view those somewhere? Whoa, what's this? Weekly challenges? This gives us XP, but what does the XP do for us? In single player. Anything? Probably in Codex. Let's take a look. Empyrean Keys. Tutorials. Arsenal? No. Demons. Stories. Maybe when we get back to our, like, uh, man cave. Perhaps. The extraction point has been right. identified. I will mark its location on your HUD. The, the extraction point has been identified. It's only uh, way over there. Excellent stuff. That's good. That's good. Oh, you hear those chants? Those are definitely the metal screamers that Mick brought in. A hundred percent. Gotta be. Okay, so there's a leap from there. Oh, what? I'm just looking for what the possible options are. Oh, that looked real close. You think that's doable, guys? I don't know. That one, this might be a bit of a stretch, this one. No, I don't think so. I'm going to try the platforms and see where it leads. Ah. Okay, well, we found it. We'll let this fall. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, oh no. All right. Didn't take our extra life. Now what? Oh, hold up. I think I can go all the way around. We'll reach the top, and then we have that thing. Okay. You gotta be kidding me. This is so cool. off my rock. Oh no! Our good friend! Our good friend is here! Wow, it's tight. 
Oh, I'm gonna die, for sure. Maybe not. What's this? What's Onslaught doing? Guys, I don't know what's happening, but it was good. Trying to find targets. Oh, that was quad D? Damn. Okay. Damn it. Weak. Weak. Me. Weak. Tell me how those aren't latching. Oh no. Give me a body to chain. Wow. Whoa, what was that? Oh, really? Right behind us. <sighs> what weapons do we have at the moment? Uh, we've got shotgun, we have the chain gun, and we have the plasma rifle. Is this harder than Doom 2016? I'm playing it on Ultra Violence, or sorry, Nightmare, compared to Ultra Violence that we played it on before, so. Yeah, but it is more difficult. But I don't know how much of that is just because of the game versus the difficulty change, you know? And that quad D for that is good. I'll take that.
Damn it. Oh, I thought I got him. I really like this riff. Oh no. I got stuck. I knew I was dead. No fuel for the chainsaw. Chainsaw is now, uh, it refills one pip. You can get additional fuel, but it's always going to refill in the bottom left there over time. Whoa. That was trippy. What the fuck? Where's that big dude? Whew. He's behind me. Whoa. Where's my friend? Got him. Guys. Don't want to get too excited here. Don't get too excited here. <laughs> They're dead. They're all dead. They're all dead. They're all dead. Tanya Dex, have a great one. Combat 9 on 10. So what does that mean exactly? So there was another secret combat encounter somewhere in there. Right? Two puppy pet redemptions? Oh. Thanks, guys. Real Commander Shepard, thanks for the Prime Sub. Sniper as well. Cariad, thank you. Kobe, 
Cuba. Thank you guys so much. Good boy, buddy. Who's a good boy? Who's the best boy? Look at him. If you can't love that face, you're pure evil. That's what I like to see. <gasps> Thank you. I appreciate that, Gamer Nurse. Thank you so much. Thanks, Falstro. <clears throat> okay. Okay. I was sick. 